Hello everyone, welcome to another video. In this video, I will show you how to fulfill orders on CJ Dropshipping. Now this is basically a platform where you can fulfill your orders for your Shopify store. I'll show you how to do it exactly. So the first step is going to my CJ here. And once you click on my CJ, what we'll have to do is we'll have to go to right here on the right side, store authorization, go to Shopify. And here, as you can see, I already connected my store. What you will have to do is you'll have to go login into your CJ dropshipping, login into your uh, Shopify store and go to your uh, apps right here. Click on the apps. And what I did is I went and installed CJ dropshipping app. So if you click here, this will be brought, uh, you'll be brought to CJ dropshipping. And here, as you can see, I already connected that right here. So once you connect that app, um, you, you know, with Shopify, you can go to CJ dropshipping here. Now, what you will have to do is you'll have to go to products, go to um, basically what you'll have to do is actually go back to CJ dropshipping. So go back to CJ dropshipping here um, on the first site. And what you will have to do is you'll have to add a product. You can add it to Q. So let's say we want to add this to Q. We add this to Q. Uh, as you can see, we have two products in Q. If we click on Q, um, yeah, you will see two products, uh, here we can click on list. Now, if we want to list this on our, uh, Shopify store, and as you can see, we have right now here, uh, we can list it. So we have CJ color, CJ shoe size, our, uh, RRP, uh, price, and we can put our price here in, uh, this is my currency, but let's say it's, you know, this, so we can put the price right here again, we can put it for um, the same price for each of these. So let's put it like this. There's, these are all the variants, by the way, and you can put this right here like that. Oops. And then what you can do is you need to put product type. Obviously, we can put a type, we can put collections, we can put vendor. This is just an example, right? And then you can click list it now, right? Once you click list it now, this will be in progress. And after this is in progress, you will basically get a product. I will right now exit out of it. But once this is done, you will be able to visit your product right here. As you can see, if we go to products here, you can see the product right here. Now uh, you can add this product to your store. If you click on the product here, we can see product status. We can see uh, obviously, um, you know, everything right here, collections, everything, right? And here we can delete a product or archive a product or we can put this product in our store. Now, let's say this product is already in a store. How to fulfill an order on CJ Dropshipping? You just go to products and what you will have to do, actually orders, not products, and then you go to order fulfillment and you will be able to fulfill your products and orders through this right here. So CJ Dropshipping will actually help you um, to you know uh, fulfill your products right here. As you can see, you can import now uh, your dropshipping orders, right? You click import now, and then you will be able to import basically, as you can see, we have zero orders. So we cannot actually, uh, you know, fulfill any orders because we have zero orders, but you can, you will be able to import it. And then you'll be able to fulfill your orders on CJ dropshipping, uh, the easiest way possible. So that's basically how to do it. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, comment down below and we'll see you in the next video. Thank you guys for watching.